I just woke up. It's around or almost 9.30. I'm watching the Belgium and England game. That's why I woke up <laughs> and I'm tired. Hi, it's so hot. I'm in the car. I've been bamboozled by my mom. We dropped off my grandparents at the airport because they're going to Armenia for like a month and a half. And I asked my mom before we left, like I specified, I'm like, we're going straight home, right? She's like, yes, we're going home. And now where am I? In the parking lot of Marshalls. And I elected not to go because I just like don't like browsing for things because I just don't like shopping other than for books. I just can't believe I've been bamboozled. it's much later it is 6 11 p.m. Had an interesting day I don't feel too well I finished everything is illuminated by Jonathan Safran for this morning I'm not counting that towards my biannual bibliothon I'm about to do today's video challenge and then I'm going to start a darker shade of magic by V.E. Schwab so the day one video challenge is to do a creative book recommendation and my idea for this was I would just text my friends and family and ask them for book recommendations so I'm just gonna go through them now. So creative, I know, but I'm going to let you guys know the books that my friends and family would recommend. Okay, hi, I've moved to my laptop because I have all the texts on my phone. So I'll put little screenshots here. So first I asked in uh, a group chat I have with a bunch of my friends. My friend Gooey, we call him Gooey, he recommended Percy Jackson and the Lightning Thief. So that's a great book. I've read it before in like middle school. It was my I loved Rick Riordan when I was younger, so I would recommend that as well. My friend Mahit recommended Harry Potter, and of course, how could you not recommend Harry Potter? If you still haven't read it, you should. The Lion King book, and he said, I've been reading this masterpiece and I can lend it to you. That's the book. The Lion King. We love that. He also recommended Gunning for Greatness, My Life by Mizut Ozil. He loves Arsenal. He's a huge Arsenal fan. He loves Mezut Ozil, so of course he would recommend me that book. But my friend Ashan recommended Car in the Hat. I'm assuming he meant Cat in the Hat. Great book. Great, great suggestions we got going on here. Ariana recommended The Alchemist. I haven't read it yet, but I want to. I've heard it's very good. She says, it's V good. My aunt recommended House of Spirits by Isabel Alande, Alende, here I go butchering names again. Never heard of that book, but my aunt recommends it. Christian recommends Scar Tissue by Anthony Kaitis. He's the Red Hot Chili Peppers lead singer. Also never heard of that book. Don't really listen to the Red Hot Chili Peppers, but my friend Christian recommends it. Marat, aka my brother's girlfriend, recommends Pachinko. Don't know who the author is right now, but I'll insert a picture here. She says it's fiction and it's good. She likes it. Sav recommends If on a Winter's Night a Traveler and Catch-22. So we love those. Haven't read any of them. Savannah also recommends Perfume. She really, really loves this one. She said, oh, read Perfume in all caps. It's so good. But Tia, aka Marette's sister, aka my brother's girlfriend's sister, <laughs> recommends any book by the Bronte sisters. She says they were pretty good, just a little weird. She also recommends The Help. Tia's friend Katie recommends A Darker Shade of Magic by V.E. Schwab, which I'm about to read, and also Throne of Glass, which I also recommend because if you haven't read that series, great, great series. Love it. Caitlin recommends The History of Love. She says it's so beautiful. My brother recommends Chimpanzee Politics. Don't know what that's about, but my brother does read a lot. Of nonfiction. My mom recommends Homo Deus. And last but not least, my friend Jordy recommends Ocean at the End of the Lane by Neil Gaiman. I still haven't read a Neil Gaiman book, which is really surprising to me, but I should get to that soon. So yeah, that's my creative book recommendations. Just surprised to get a response from so many people. We love that. We love responses. We love when your friends text you back. So now I'm just doing the Instagram challenge for today, which is a rainbow challenge. I'm taking that picture. If you want to see it, go to my Instagram at t.reads. I still haven't started a darker shade of magic. I suck.
it's 11 12 and i'm just settling to get into bed i have read zero today well i finished everything as illuminated but i'm not counting that towards this readathon so today's been mostly a fail but i have been productive with other things which is nice i edited most of today's vlog so that i can add just a few little clips at the end and upload it before i go to bed tonight i'm about to start a darker shade of magic by ve schwab and i'm really excited I'm going to try and get as much reading done as I can before I absolutely cannot stay awake anymore. Tomorrow's the World Cup final, so I'm getting up at like 8.30 to watch that. I might just stay up until like 1 or 2, I don't know. We'll see where the night takes me. I hope to get at least 100 pages in to this before I go to bed. I will check in later and we'll see what time it is. like 12.05 and I'm only 20 pages in. My mom's sleeping right beside me so I'm trying to be really quiet. Day one is officially over. So I guess I read 20 pages in day one. <laughs> nice. I guess that's gonna be all for today's vlog. I'll see you guys tomorrow with the video challenge and all that stuff. Bye! I just ran honey I dash. You spend too much cash. Screw your bags. I knew that you wouldn't last. I'm in physics class. I knew that you wouldn't ask. She got too much shot. What I'm finna do with all that? Talked to Elon last week. Told him I whip too fast.